Previously on... No one! No one but you! What? It's cold, isn't it? What is the river? Where am I? This place looks familiar. Psst! Hey, bruh! Hideaki! Wake up, bestest buddy! Bruh! Huh? Hey, leave Hideaki alone! He'll never want to get up if he thinks you're waiting for him! Don't listen to him, Hikun! Listen only to the sound of my voice! Fuck, Megumi, damn! <laughs> Quietly, and gently, smoothly, my voice is filling your mind! Holy shit, girl! When you open your eyes, you will fall in love with the first... Damn! Bruh! Wake up already! Uh, what the fuck? That... Uh, uh. Following Ryo's lead, we both started walking down the road to Ryo's house. Alright, buddy. Ryo kept talking the whole time, but I wasn't really keeping up with him. He kept switching subject every few minutes. This guy is pretty fucking annoying, but at least he means well. Here we are, bruh! After a short walk, we arrived at Ryo's house. It looks like it's getting dark, yeah. Anyway, it looks like a normal house, as expected. Nothing in particular stands out. Ryo doesn't look like a rich guy, so his family is probably average, like mine. After greeting Ryo's mother, Two of us headed into his room. Doi! Nice place, I like your room! Nice! Yeah, this is the casual room, I should say. Yeah, the one in uh, Hideaki's room. That room totally looks like an inn. Yeah, this looks more casual. Yeah, and student like. Yeah, and what is that? You guys see that? The one in the, mi the bottom one? One of the picture, yeah. It looks like a, a purple uh, eggplant, I don't know, and a green uh, uh, and, uh. What the fuck is that? And there's a basketball. Oh, wait, is this the reference to uh. Oh! Oh! Is this the reference to uh. Uh. Oh god, I'm forgetting the anime name already. Kuroko no Baski, yeah. Is it? I feel like it is because well if it's so then the green should be a little taller right because that should be Midorima right ah fuck it yeah just fuck it right but I think that is a reference to yeah Kuroko no Basuke yeah good job yeah I don't know about the other three on the top Yes, but then it might take a while, so nah. Anyway, let's move on. Yeah. Hold on. It's weird to see someone with more video games than I have. Hold on. Is that a Shingeki no Kyojinza? A figure right there on your table? Oh well, yeah. Anyway, sorry about that. Just, just wondering, yeah. Anyway, moving on. That's where all my money goes, bruh! No fucking kidding, right? Leo sat down on his bed, and I started walking around the room, checking out his stuff. You have a really, uh, interesting manga and anime collection. Super Magic Girls Trilogy. <laughs> really? Hey, don't judge by his cover, bruh! You're pretty fucking awesome, bruh! Sure! Forget about that, bruh. Let's play some games, bruh. I hope it's not a Super Magic Girls game or something. 
I mean, I don't mind personally, but yeah. But what? Of course not. As he said that I caught Neil's hiding something beneath its pillow. Uh-huh. Busted, bruh. I have the latest Indoor Fighter 6 game. We can play that. What the fuck is an Indoor Fighter 6? Whatever. Oh, I love Indoor Fighter. I think it's a yeah, I think it's great how they fight in nicely furnished homes and get bonus points for not trashing the place. Okay. It's certainly much more entertaining than fighting outside, like on the street or something, right? Fighting out on the streets? Don't be silly, bruh. That's just dangerous, bruh. Uh, I think either way is kind of dangerous. Anyway, alright, I'll pop it in and let's play. God, it's night time. Dude, you're really good at this, bruh. I didn't expect that. You're pretty good too, bruh. I let out all my anger in these type of games, bruh. So I think it's time well spent. Anger? You don't seem like the kind of guy who gets angry. On the contrary, bruh. I actually get angry pretty easy, bruh. I see. That would explain why he doesn't have any friendos. <laughs> Huh? You learn something new every day. Yeah. You should keep that in mind. Yeah, bruh. Do it! Punched your shoulder. Hunde <laughs> dale. Oh well. Hey, hey bruh! Why did you do that, bruh? Hmm. Didn't work. You don't sound so angry, bruh. I wouldn't get angry over something like that, Hideaki. Bruh, what the fuck? Oh well, it was worth a shot, man. <laughs> uh, Neo stared at me blankly, obviously unamused by my antiques. Antiques, I mean. Anyway, I should start heading home now, bruh. Huh? Why, bruh? I told you. I'm not mad at you, bruh. It's not that, dude. We've been here for quite a while, haven't we? Look, it's dark outside, so yeah, I'm leaving, bruh. Yo, look at his clock. Now that you mention it, I guess you're right, bruh. Pull myself up. Hey, Hideaki, we should hang out like this more often, bruh. This morning, I would have rejected the idea, but now? Yeah, you're right. I actually had fun today. I'll see you later, man. See ya, bruh. That will be the last time we will meet Rio. <laughs> uh, anyway. Hey, I'm back, Mom. Where have you been? The second I walked through the door, my mother emerged with a worried look on her face. With a shotgun. Wait. I, uh, <clears throat> I went to a friend's house, Mom. Don't worry. You had me really worried, Hideaki. You should have told me. Ah, oh, damn. I knew I forgot something. The whole reason mom brought me a cell phone was to avoid moments like this, yeah. I'm sorry, mom. But seriously, chill out, mom. You should stop worrying about me so much. I'm a grown man. What? I just don't want you to get hurt. So it's about that again, huh? I know you're worried about me because of what happened when I was young. But that accident was a long time ago, mom. I'm not a kid anymore. Grow man, I can take care of myself, Mom. I don't want you to get all worked up like this, okay? Mom? Oh, okay. I'll try. That's good enough for me. So, uh, what's for dinner, Mom? Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I haven't had time to make anything. What? It's okay, Mom. I'll just make a sandwich for myself. You want some? All right, honey. I'll be in my room if you need me. Okay, Mom. Good night. I made a sandwich, then went up to my room. <sighs> I guess it's about time I went to bed. Yo. This looks luxurious as fuck compared to Neil's room. Goddamn. Anyway. 
I was over at Radio's house for a surprisingly long time, and the constant in-game shouting wore me out. I guess I'll just converse or conserve my remaining energy for the weekend. But yeah, it's Friday. I totally forgot the date. Yeah. Persona! Saturday the 12th! Man, I love that system so much! Ah. <gasps> Ring! Ring! Uh, fuck. What the heck? Who could be calling me at this hour? Actually, that's a good question. Not many people have my number, since I rarely use my phone for calls, man. Picked up the phone and answered. Uh, hello? Hideaki! My man! Uh, what the f- uh, Who is this, man? Is this a fucking prank call? What? No, bro, it's me, Leo! Uh, calling me the morning after, Leo? What the fuck, dude? It's getting a little creepy, man. Leo? How the hell do you have my number? What the fuck? You got it from me, Gooby. Traded her one hour of day time for it. <laughs> what the fuck is this trade? Okay, hold on. How the fuck does Megumi know my number? Ah, oh, that makes sense. No, it doesn't. What the fuck? Wait a minute. How did she get my number? Exactly. And for that matter, what the heck is day time? Ah, uh, oh, fuck. Get it, man. Why are you calling me so early in the morning, man? To hang out, of course, bruh! Oh, fuck. Dude, I didn't... Didn't I visit your place just yesterday, dude? Best friends hang out every day, bruh! Oh, I'm beginning to reset this so-called friendship of ours, man. I, dude, I don't know about that, man. I'd rather spend the day sleeping. Like... Ah! Okay, great, bruh. I'll be at your house in 15 minutes, bruh! What? What? Dude, I... See ya, bruh! Leo, hang up. Oh, fuck, dude. N not cool. Well, I could have done without that. Ah. What's more? Now I have to get out of bed. Fucking A. Pull myself out of bed and walk to the closet. Uh, let's see, uh, what should I wear? Uh, it could be anything because it's just Leo, right? Yeah. The weather seems nice outside, so maybe I should go with this. And again, it's. this shirt looks better on me. Huh. Why am I even thinking this is so hard? What the heck am I doing? It's not like I'm going out a day, yeah! I just, I just, I, I should just wear whatever feels comfortable, yeah. But also remain reasonably fashionable. After all, I have a reputation to uphold here. Change outfits and head it downstairs. It's already 15 minutes? Fuck. Oh, you're all dressed up. Are you going somewhere? Yeah. Going out with the guy from yesterday, Mom. Oh! My mom's eye brightened up. I thought you were back strangely late last night. So, my little boy has grown up in a man, huh? What is she? I am a man, Mom. What the fuck? Uh, what? No! Wait, no! Hold on! No! No! Mom! I I thought you meant no. I misread what you just. Yeah, no, mom. Well, hold on. No, it wasn't like that, mom. We're just friends. Holy shit! Did I misread that? I thought she said I was grown into a real man or something. No, I don't mean by grown into a man as in love, mom. What the fuck? No, 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 mom. Just no. Don't no. 
No, no, calm down. Mommy loves you no matter which TV you bat for. Fuck, Mom, no. I'm telling you, it's not like that. Seriously, I could do way better, man. Damn. Yeah, wishes he could handle this. Fuck. Yeah. <sighs> Whatever. I'll be going now, Mom. See you later. All right. Have fun. I put my shoes on and exited the house. Fuck, Mom. Damn. Yo, Hideaki, bruh! Oh, you're already here. How did you know where I live, huh? I stalked you last night, bruh. Yo, get the fuck out of my house, bruh! Damn! That is not cool! Stop the- Ah! You what? <laughs> that looks like your face is priceless, bruh! Chill, man, I was kidding. I asked Megumi, duh! <sighs> and I thought having my mom teasing me was bad. I see. Surprise, she told you. Ah. How many hours of heat day time did it cost you, huh? Three. I'm getting pretty low now, bruh. <laughs> In fact, this outing well pretty much wiped me out for a week ahead. the fuck is this transaction or no, this trade, yeah? No, I won't ask. Anyway, uh, let's get going, bruh. Alright, where are we going anyway? I'm assuming you were still having had a good look around the town, right, bruh? Uh, no, not really. Not since I was a kid, at least. Well, uh, there's a nearby mall we can visit, bruh. Yeah, let's do that. I'll show you where all the cool kids hang out, bruh. Okay. Once again, I think it would be best not to comment. Alright, uh, I'm game. Let's do this. God damn it. My first date is a guy? Fuck. Without further speculation, Neil and I walk to the mall. 50% off? That is nice. And it says move, move, move on the top right. <laughs> Alright. This kind of looks cool. Yeah. Anyway, let's move on. Since we arrived, the two of us have done little more than walk around exploring the surprisingly large complex. So far, this trip has been about getting to know my way around. There are a fair number of interesting stores around here. I can certainly see myself coming back. What's more, it isn't very crowded in here, so I don't feel like I needed to rush around. Hey, I'm getting thirsty. You want a drink, bruh? I suppose that's only natural. We had been walking around nonstop. All right, uh, please do. Okay, wait for me here, bruh. I will, yeah. Ryo turned around and began his search for a vending machine. I think this is the time to bail! <laughs> uh, wait, why didn't we just go together? Exactly! I'm just standing here, waiting for Ryo, while he's buying me something. Yeah, what if... What? what? Uh, I'm all, it almost feels like... A fucking date. Maybe this is a date after all. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, as I began to powder my warring relationship with Ryo, I heard someone call my name. <gasps> what? Hideaki. Ah, so it is you. I didn't think I'd see you here. Oh. Hi, Hachiko. <laughs> It's been a while. Yeah, I guess that's a casual close. Alright, then. What are you doing here? I was out with some friends, but they had to leave, so I kept shopping on my own. I see. What about you? What are you doing here? I'm actually out with Dio at the moment. Dio? Of all the people you could have chosen, you decided to hang out with him? 
telling you I should have charged him more for your phone number. Hey, uh, it's bad enough that you're auctioning off my phone number to begin with. In fact, how the fuck do you even know my phone number? What, what is this? Wait, no. Yeah, how the heck did you get my number? Now, now, don't be like that, Hideaki. It's perfectly natural for us to have each other's number, isn't it? Well, guess so. You're kind of creeping me out, girl. Anyway, but wait, I don't have your phone number. Yeah, sure you do. Don't you ever, don't you ever use your phone? Just to be certain, I checked my phone. What? Surely enough, there were several new entries, none of which I recognized. Oh my god! I'm guessing that's you! Meg, Megumi, Megumi H, Megumi Hinohara, Mi M Chan. Chotto. Oi! Chotto watte yo! How? Why? What the fuck? C calm down, Aki! I use inside voice, or use your inside voice, okay? Oi! Ch. Matte yo, oi! What the fuck is this? Did you, like, add your contact list with. Uh, uh, what? Shikawa, how many did you put? You put like six! Oh my god. This girl. is dangerous as fuck! Oh my god. This is like the beginning of how ya did it goes, man. Damn! Oh my god. Oh well, you know, I'll just go on with it. Anyway, and that's another thing. Why do you keep swapping between Hideaki, Aki, and Hiku? Yeah. Oh my god. Is it triplets? What? I feel like I'm having an identity crisis here. Oh, Hide, don't be such a drama queen. There's a perfectly reasonable explanation for all of this. You see, first I... Here you go, Hideaki! Bruh, Anna! Oh my fucking god, bruh! If it isn't Megumi! If I knew you were here, I would have brought you one too! You can have mine if you want it, bruh! No, thank you! So yourself, girl! I'm probably going to regret fanning the flames, but uh. You can have some of mine if you want. Megumi chan? <laughs> I love him! What the hell? You agree to share his without batting an eye, bruh? What the f Um, I just like his. Or I just like his flavor better. But we have the exact same flavor, bruh! I knew this would have happened. <laughs> uh. Sorry, Dio. This is your punishment for waking me up in such an ungodly hour. Waking me, I mean waking me up in an ungodly hour. Dio, just calm down. I, it's not a big deal. Everyone's out to get me, bruh. Oh, cheer up, Dio. More importantly, look over there. Isn't that Yui? Yui? You mean the one from class? That girl? How many Yui's do you know? Yeah, it does look like her. Actually, this might be a good opportunity. Is it? Should I lure Ryo into the lion's den? I don't know. Depending on what the fuck is Yui doing? Is she working? Is she shopping? Is she like with her family? Is she by herself? I need more information, buddy. I mean, I could just troll right now. Or just, you know. <laughs> yeah. But I don't want you to be all pissed off, you know? I mean, I want to have Yui's good side. I want to see her smile. You know what I'm saying? Even though she might be a little tsundere, but you know. Yeah, sometimes the good thing about tsundere is that even the tsun tsun part is 
It's sometimes worth to find that 10% of Dara, you know what I'm saying? Yeah! Hold on! <sighs> okay. Time to go! What the fuck not, right? Yeah. Hey, Diola, maybe you should go talk to her. You really think so, bruh? But wait, you know that she not very keen on me, bruh. That's an understatement, bruh. Nah, you should, yeah, you should be alright, buddy. I'm sure she just liked that at school. You're right, bruh. I should go talk to her. I knew I was right to befriend a playboy like you. <laughs> okay. I know I should feel flattered, but still. Leo started running in Yui's direction. Ha ha ha! Oh, Hideaki, you're so mean! What? I just want him to be happy. Hold on, just wait. Wait, 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 hold on. If I decided to not bother her, would there be a chance to meeting her? Because now I'm with Megumi-chan. Oh, shit. Ah, fuck it, I'm going with it. Oh, there he goes. Take that Mr. Wakes People Up at Dawn. Oh no! It looks like she's or he's asking her to drink from his can! Are you serious, dude? What the fuck? This isn't fucking good. Oh wait! She actually took it from him! Maybe she really N never mind. She's pouring it all over his head! In public? Damn! Yep, that makes more sense. Now she's balancing the can on his head while he's standing there. I saw it coming. The crazy thing is, he's just standing there laughing. Much guy, boy. It. Oh my god, that is fucking. Oh. The pain. Oh, bruh! That kid sure is weird! Oh, he's coming back. Pretend like you weren't watching, okay, Megumi? Just shut up, bye, like, girl. Yo! You're back! Hey there, buddy. How did it go? Megumi and I tried to hold in our laughter. It actually went pretty well, bruh! Uh, wh what? She talked to me for more than two minutes. That's a new record. Oh, no. That is just sad, Neo. Fuck. Ah. I should have been more nice to you, bruh. Fuck. That is just sad. Ah. Never pity another human being to this extent in my entire life. Well, that's good. Maybe next time you can talk without drinks getting spilled everywhere, yeah. One can only hope, bruh. At any rate, let's not bother her anymore. So what do you guys plan on doing now? I'm not sure. We're probably just going to hang around or something, yeah. Sounds fun. Can I come along with you guys? Hey, stop eating up my heyday time, girl. Damn. I'm scraping the bottom of the bear as it is, you know. Then, you should be begging me to come along since it won't count if we're both here. Oh. You give me, my friend. Please do Hideaki and I the honor of escorting us as we patrol this fine establishment, girl. I would be... Honored, kind sir. What the fuck is this shit? God, I think I need to start picking my friends a little better. But seriously, man. <sighs> Night time. As the day dragged on, and our outing came to a close, the three of us headed home. Leo separated from Megumi and I fairly quickly, since we weren't far from his house leaving Megumi and I to walk home together. Thanks for walking me home! No problem, girl. Today was surprisingly fun! Leo isn't as bad as I thought. 
Yeah, he might seem a bit peculiar, but he means well. Why do I have a feeling that you don't live here? Anyway, if you say so. Anyway, I have to go now. We should hang out like this more often. Yeah, I think so too. Great! I'll see you tomorrow. Night, he day. Good night, girl. Wait, did Megumi just subtly reveal that she's going to seek me out tomorrow? Oh, what? And that, meaning today, at the mall? That was a coincidence, right? Oh my god, this is kinda getting scary, bruh! After returning to my own home at long last, I greeted my mother in the kitchen. Man, I walked a lot today. How was your date? What? No, mom, what the f- No! Uh, I mean, uh, did you enjoy hanging out? <sighs> mom... It was fun, mom. We came across another friend of mine in town. Oh my, you become quite popular already. Not really, Mom. You're being modest. You know that everyone loves you. Yeah, you're starting to embarrass me, Mom. Anyway, uh, I'm exhausted. I'll go up to my room now, okay, Mom? Don't you want to eat dinner first? Nah, we ate out. Right now, I just want to sleep. Alright, honey. Good night. Night, Mom. Ah, it feels so good to change clothes after a long day. I would seriously stay in these pajamas all day if I could. Damn you, society. You judgmental bitch. Ugh. I opened the window and looked outside. Hold on, there better not be Megumi, I swear to fucking god. Hmm, the breeze is nice, and so it is this view. I didn't notice before, but I can see the river from here. What a great sight, and it somehow feels so nostalgic. As feeling of time past got the best of me, I saw a figure emerge by the river. Eh? Eh? That's weird, who could be there this late at night? I kept staring at the unmoving figure. Eh, just wait. Perhaps I'm just imagining things. I'm pretty tired after all. Maybe I should just go to bed. Eh? I walked over to my bed, laid down, and closed my eyes. Was that Megumi? What the fuck? <laughs> 